Hi, this is El Tito of Survival. In today's video, we'll talk about survival books. Um, it's a follow-up, basically, on FS Bushcraft uh, uh, Bushcraft Library. Uh, mine's going to be a little more on survival. So stay tuned. After the the, the intro, we'll be uh, talking about this book. This one is in French, but it is the SIS uh, Survival in Book. Uh, from uh, John Wiseman. We'll be right back. Well, everybody knows this book. SIS Survival Handbook. This one is the translation of the original which was published in 1986. It's a revised edition. Um, it's a translation of the revised edition uh, up to 2003. So it's not an old book but um, I think the text has not been updated that much. There is many things um, in there that we uh, we kind of find odd. Uh, not necessarily they're bad, but they're simply uh, maybe not up to date. So, uh, one example is on battening. Um, he suggests using a rock, which is a no no. <laughs> if you want to break your knife, that's the best way. A baton basically is a baton, you use a branch. So, uh, if you use a rock, well, you're in for a broken knife for sure. But, uh, that's one of the uh, the things you know every book you're going to be reading got to be critical of the information uh, first they might be not centered on your area and plants wildlife and everything might not be corresponding yours so that's one thing and the second thing you've got to adapt what it's in in there it's the view often of one uh, particular fellow or a uh, training agency uh, that you uh, that you uh, will find in the back so sometimes uh, these are not updated that much and they come from a training some people have received a, f a long time ago and things change thing evo evolve but this book is not bad it's a base book which you're going to use to learn the basic uh, basically what you should have in your kit, what you should um, consider, prepare for terrain, climate, uh, traps, and other things. So you have to uh, to be uh, to learn the things, the basic things, trappings. Uh, in there, you'll find some traps, some interesting traps. Not sure you're gonna see that correctly, but. It's all drawing, line drawing, and uh, you can uh, you can find many of the good thing how to uh, take care of uh, the the, uh, the thing you've ca you've caught and how to prepare the meals, type of uh, shelter. Uh, you've got all kinds of it for every weather. This one is uh, uh, is covering most of the area you'll encounter on Earth. So. Um, how to improvise your equipment, type of uh, stove, how to start fire, kitchen, what you should cook, where you should find things, what you can build, uh, rope making, knot making, net making, orientation. Okay, to give you basic on orientation, how to read the, uh, the line of the train and everything. Uh, some meteorology, how to carry your stuff, uh, first aid, remedies, and dangerous toxin, things like that. So it's not a bad book. It's a it's a book that somebody that is more advanced might not appreciate that much because lots of information is basic. It doesn't show you how. It just show you what. Um, the how is up to you to learn. So. Not a bad book, it's a good read, and it's 
probably one of those that started them all so one that I might that you might want to read at least for the base information it's always good to have many different uh, type so well this is a basic handbook so it's one and I recommend I've read it uh, many basic information if you like this video please click the button like share and subscribe all those good things if you have comment please join them down below and as FS Bushcraft told me uh, anybody can show us the books they like to read so the book they have in their library uh, on survival bushcraft and wildlife so it's all good it's all to uh, get people knowledge of those books and then they can buy them and build their own uh, knowledge also in those books so like I said if you like it click the thumbs up and we'll see you in the next video